In this video, you'll learn how to create a new score and input a simple melody. After logging in, click New Score on your home screen. Let's start by creating a private piano score, which you'll be able to share later if you want. Select the first measure to begin inputting notes. You can create a melody by clicking on the staff to input notes where you want them. The blinking cursor shows where your note will go. This is the insertion point for a new note. Since our melody requires a dotted rhythm in the last measure, we will need something other than a quarter note. When you select a part of the score, it is highlighted in orange, like the note you see here. You can change the duration of a selected note by using the editing palette. Note that the editing palette includes tools for note duration, accidentals, lyrics, text, articulations, and guitar tabs. Here, we'll use the basic editing palette to dot the quarter note in the fourth measure and then create an eighth note and a half note using the buttons on the palette. You can also input notes quickly by using the keyboard. To demonstrate this, we will add a simple bass line. To add a note, Simply type in a letter between A and G. Notice how the period key will add a dot to a note. To change between note durations, use the left and right bracket keys. The backspace key will delete a note. If you are a NoteFlight Crescendo user, you may also input notes into your score directly from a MIDI device connected to your computer. Creating a chord in NoteFlight is easy. To do so, you may either use the mouse to add notes above or below a selected note, or use the shift key and type in the name of the desired note. If you ever make a mistake, you can undo up to 20 actions by choosing Edit, Undo from the drop-down menu. Let's play back what we just created by clicking on the play symbol at the bottom of the editor. You can add a title to your score and write in the composer and lyricist. Finally, you may save your score using File, Save from the drop-down menu. For more information on all of NoteFlight's features, check out the online user guide. Thanks for watching!